Yeah, that's the good logo. Did you recognize that logo? Hey, by the way, grab the controller and press any button. I will like press now. the any button. Very good. Uh, I recognize. Uh, you can also press new game. Damn, I really like the like that the logo is glitchy. That's kind of fun. That is kind kind of fun. Well, this I game think. does not support autosave. Play the game to find out how to save, you <laughs> dumb idiot. Uh, we're playing Near Automata. Uh, it's been like a little bit more than a year, I think, since we played Near Replicant together. And that uh, was quite a trip. That was quite a trip. Quite an, uh, don't, not quite yet. Uh, I want to talk about a couple things before we begin. First of all, you might have seen there was a lot of bullshit at the top of the screen, uh, mm -hmm. right as we booted the game. That's because this is modded. Uh, it's not like any uh, cosmetic mods or anything, it's just performance mods and uh, a bit. Uh, what I got is something called the Fix Automata Resolution Mod, because it needs fixing. <laughs> um, this is a PC version of this video game that came out in 2017. When it came out in 2017, the PC version was fucked. It was barely holding together and I needed to actually roll back to earlier drivers on my graphics card to even play it. <laughs> uh, that sounds like it's something they did wrong there. That's like... It's... It, fucked times... I don't know. It, was, it wasn't good. It's better now. You can play this game without mods and it's fine. Uh, the mods I have fixed a few things like... Um, Render distance, uh, it like fixes some anti-aliasing, something, uh, things I don't know. It looks better for the mods. It looks like how I think it should look on PC. It's kind of funny that modders could fix what the devs could. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. The they did the Bethesda not. thing. Uh, but the characters are not going to be dressed like VTubers. Uh, <laughs> we're not going to be fighting using body pillows. Uh, like Dante and Virgil. <laughs> uh, but well, all that's if it, fine. If you guys started with that, uh, I would have walked out yeah. through the door. So, this is Nier Automata. We're gonna play it. Uh, Varyurum is here. Yes. If you haven't noticed. Hello. And Vigo is here. Uh, Vigo knows very little about this game, and I put the controller in your hands, Vigo. Uh, you've told me you've kind of been spoiled on a boss. A boss and the story of that boss. A little bit of the story. You said some interesting things, some things I'm not entirely sure if I agree with. So we'll, we'll see how that turns out. <laughs> I don't know shit about Nier Automata. No, but, but it's good that yeah. the things you said were kind of bullshit as well. I don't know if I agree not... with the things I said. Because I don't know the yeah. things I said. And Varyurum, you have played Final Fantasy XIV. Yeah. Is XIV right? Yeah. Yeah, it's fourteen. Uh, uh, online usually so. that had the crossover event with near automata well it's not an event it's well it's a raid so but the problem is i have no idea what's going on see i know so little about memorpigers uh, that uh, i don't know the difference between a raid and an event but that's fine you know about that i've been told things about that i know a little bit about it i don't quite understand either but apparently it's canon <laughs> to what? Nier Automata. Well, Yoko Taro has gone out and said that everything is canon. If 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 the character from Nier Automata is in it, it's canon. Uh, he's just given well, a blank well, <laughs> statement. Well, I'm still thinking it's funny that he tried to convince um, Final Fantasy Online developers that when the raid was finished, your character would be deleted. Yes, yes, he, that's and something. And he's had, he had to go. No, no. Hey, we speaking don't of deleted do that. characters, you might notice that there are no data slots, uh, and you might be thinking, "Huh, near replicant made you delete your save file at the end." I wonder if this game does the same. I'm not going to confirm nor deny, but I'm going to ask you: Do you think Yokotaro is the kind of guy to do the same thing twice? I would say no, because he's insane enough to think he... Uh, to but that might be what he wants you to think. Yeah, that's <laughs> the problem, that he wants me to think that uh, he's, so I'm not he's going not to a one-trick pony. I'm not going to confirm or deny anything, but I... I mean, Yokotaro is insane, maybe he just... I would have deleted my save files anyways. Actually, the title screen you saw is one that unlocks when you beat the game. Uh, I kind of considered doing like a factory wipe. 
like I did for DMC5 when we played that. <laughs> because I didn't want you to see fucking Virgil on the title screen. Uh, I would have wiped it anyways, but so just putting that out there. I think we might as well start the video game. I mean, uh, Yokotaro is insane. Maybe he just uninstalls the game when you beat it. <laughs> Well, maybe the whole, it, uh, fuck, it, it maybe refunds, the whole computer gets it refunds uninstalled. the game on Steam. <laughs> it refunds the game, uninstalls and wipes it. They no, but I have definitely it. played this game, if that was ever in question. I have more than 150 hours. I have all achievements as of a few weeks ago. Press the button, by the I've way. S I've gotten notices on my Pre press the button that you have been playing near Amada. Yes. Create save data. We're going to create a save data, and it's going to have a username. Uh, it's not gonna be the name of the main character this time around. Name it Jerry. Jerry? Yes. We could do Jerry. I also have a suggestion, which is because... Uh, Varium, Vigo, that's two Vs. You're gonna be the ones actually playing. I'm suggesting two V, which is gonna s make a lot of sense with the game. Okay. That's my suggestion. So, two V. Two V. Two so V or not two V? That was terrible stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. Uh, which I think is fine. Please go ahead and confirm. Yes. Yes, I would like to confirm. Uh, okay, so hard difficulty is a joke. It's a very <laughs> funny joke. It makes it very, very hard to get past even the tutorial. Because you die in two hits. From anything. Literally anything will kill you in two hits. So who even plays very hard then? Uh, I have been in the game on very hard. It wasn't easy. I did it. Is it, like it actually gets easier after the tutorial because you can like grind for levels and stuff. Uh, I think normal is fine. Norm normal is the way it should be played. Actually, hard and very hard also turns off some... Uh, uh, settings should be fine. Well, let's see if I figure out uh, the context of the whole story at all because... Everything but, that lives yeah. is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped in a never-ending spiral of life and death. Is this a curse or some kind of punishment? I often think about the god who blessed us with this cryptic puzzle and wonder if we'll ever have the chance to kill him. So that's one way to start a video game. Mm -hmm. That's uh, Kira Buckland. Uh, she, she is a voice actress. Yeah, let, 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 him, let him talk about it. All units have penetrated the stratosphere. So that's why I suggested 2B. The main character is 2B. We got 1D, 11B, 4B, 12H, and 7E. Well, we already lost one. Yeah. Yep. 12H down. All units that's 12H. Yep, that's a problem. What's the white one? The white one uh, designates the leader. So you're in control. Uh, and this game is a top-down shoot-em-up. I don't believe you. I think he did the thing where he likes game and he puts it in the game. Maybe. So do you wanna... Do you, do you, do you wanna beat the game right now? Kill yourself. If you kill yourself, you get an ending. Alert. How do I kill myself? You take damage. You can if you want to. You don't have to. I kinda wanna see the ending. By all means. So, uh, run into all the bullets. Actually, you might not be able to at this point. Because you have auto-use items. No, you, you should be able to. If you just... If you just run into the next possible, uh... Death beam. Death laser. Uh... Death Star laser, maybe. I don't know. Do you think you're flying at the Death Star? I don't know. I think I'm flying at a bunch of orbs. Orb! Okay. Get in the way. So that's it. Uh, you died. The Yora Force was annihilated and Earth went on to become a paradise for the machines. Huh. So huh. we're fighting a robot. Uh, Ro what did you think they looked like? Press X. Uh -huh. Did you think it was a Nagatamaguchi or something? Congratulations, you got ending W. <laughs> w stands Thanks for, for watching win. the Let's Play. Uh, I hope to see you guys next time. I'm joking.
everything that lives is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped. So this is a very interesting speech that you should try and remember. I mean, it sounds like it seems like life, really. Yeah, it's. Um, there are multiple variations of this. So much like, much like the first near, there's a bunch of side content. Uh, mm -hmm. Mainly, there's a strategy guide with a few stories in it. There's like uh, a world guide. Wait, did you say stretchy guide? Strategy guide. Oh! <laughs> I don't know if it's stretchy, I haven't felt it. Uh, and there was also a few stories performed at the live concerts of the music. One of those is another ending, <laughs> which is arguably the true ending, mm. which was performed at exactly one out of six concerts, the fifth one. Oh, it sounds like the, something they would do because... fuck us, I guess. Yeah. Fuck right, us. there's so more. Yep. Uh, your buttons don't do nothing yet. You don't have... Uh, Rip that girl, I guess. Yes. These are, in fact, all girls. Uh, depending on how you define girl, I suppose. Which is not some sort of... Not boy. That's a good definition, I like no, it. No, it's not only the... Okay, you have guns now. Uh, uh, you also have evade. That's the simplest definition. I think you have evade too. Reverse of boy? Yeah, that's better. You have evade. Inverted boys. <laughs> Inverted boys. Malfunction <laughs> boys. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, fuck these balls. Well, it is uh, normal to see balls in a uh, near game. So. Oh yeah, the, the balls are a classic. Wait, can I fucking name? They went to white one. That's Remember one Bayonetta when you could just flip the camera when dodge rolling? Oh yeah! Oh, ah, fancy! You can actually change your color. Hey, I'm yes. the leader. The colors are. It's like me. I'm the leader so you, now. So you have attacks now. You have X and Y, uh, uh, which are square and and triangle. Yes. You have a PlayStation controller. Fear canto triangle. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Uh, now smack him. Smack him? Oh, smack him! Yeah, and shoot at the same time, which you can. This do. reminds me of that game that we played recently. Of uh, Zoe? Yeah. A little bit. A little mm. bit. Do I have a grab? No. Fuck. I'm afraid you don't. Can I boost? You can dodge. Can I do? So uh, we we've spirit. lost five friends so far, and yeah. we've been playing for like three minutes. Yeah. That was an expensive loss. Yes. Um, especially considering uh, Yokotaro has actually been asked. Maybe we should wait with that until we know a little bit more about so this is what we actually are. As far as in speed position or what the fuck? Uh, I suppose. High speed position. Be ready to dodge some bullshit. Eh. Oh fuck, I'm... I hate this. <laughs> <laughs> wow. wow. My reflexes are actual shit. <laughs> Well, this sounds like a huge I mean, problem. you can't be like me who knows where those are just by memory. <laughs> so you can. Uh, that sounds fucking horrible to memorize the dark, all those. The dark bullets you can hit with your uh, swings. You can still swing in this mode. Huh. And that's like a shield thing. Well, it's, it's mm. actually an attack, but also uh, a shield, I guess. Oh, all different. <laughs> old games where you did this ah, kind of fuck. shooting. I'm yeah. being dumb. Oh, don't you have auto item on? I thought the game auto used items for you at this point. Well, uh, we're doing the black and white, I suppose. Yep. Maybe I shouldn't have... There we go. You leveled up. Sick. So, got a second chance. Don't fuck it up. <laughs> oh. 
Just swing through through, and you should be fine. Swing, swing for life. Uh, so remember when I said that on hard mode, these bullets kill you in two hits. That sounds horrible. Why would anyone play that? <laughs> To, to be able to tell swing it. swing yeah, swing why, why, why can't swinging? I do the sh I'm pressing the square button I am mashing the square excuse me can you please do something so they caught you in startup and counter hit you like 17 times <laughs> that was kind of rude you can't shoot at the same time just hold the shoot button while you swing Think, think of it like being Virgil and, and constantly summon sorting everyone. So what you're saying I'm is that I'm Virgil? I mean, you have white hair as evident by this. Do I, ha I have a katana! Yep, you're Virgil. <laughs> I'm Virgil. I am the storm that is uh, approaching. Oh, I remember so many times I've seen people with that outfit uh, wandering around in Final Fantasy Online. This design is so good. I this actually seen design. even men have that kind of thing. Yeah. <laughs> weird. weird uh, you also have a lock on on your. So, hey, these boys look kind of familiar. You've probably seen them somewhere. Probably. You oh, might I, recognize I, the I shape of their heads. Oh shit! I have big sword. Yeah, and you can charge it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I, I'm gonna use the big attack. So I don't know if you brought up Bayonetta because you actually remember or notice, but. Uh, the thing that got people interested about this game was that, hey, is... Oh, I can juggle people! You can. I am Virgil. You can make combo videos with this game. They're not as intricate as Devil May Cry, but you can make them. Yeah, I wasn't... I wasn't expecting it to be Devil May Cry intricate. I would have uh, been very surprised. Which it was. isn't, but it's close. Because this is... Um, this, this is made by Fuck Platinum. Balls. Yeah. This is made by Platinum, who made Bayonetta. Uh, which is why I got interested in the first place. This game is the reason I... Oh, I got the fucking... Uh, what's it called? I don't know. When you throw the sword and it... Ah, uh, uh, round trip. Yeah, round trip. Kind of. It doesn't stay out, but... Not really. Oh, here comes uh, someone. So your left trigger is a lock-on, by the way. Uh, left. Trigger. Can... Do I need to hold it down? A trigger, not bumper. Not bumper. Uh, or stick. No. Svdik. Ah, shit. Oh. Careful with the controller, it can come unplugged. Okay, so I can still shoot. You can always shoot. So I wanna want you to pay attention to the music that's about to start playing. Not mm quite. -hmm. Big boy. I think. You know what I think? Okay, I listen, think... listen. While you fight. Oh shit! That's an arm. Yes. I don't know if you can tell already. <laughs> but d dodge. Remember to dodge. And go up and hit it when it slows down. Kuata Song of the Hey, you learned the lyrics again! This is a version of the Song of the Asians. Yep. Man, uh, that song's good. It still uh, can be hilarious that uh, for the Olympics they actually used it. They did! They did! They did! And, and my father was asking me, why did you have a, a strange <laughs> <laughs> look in, on your face? Why did uh, you start freaking the fuck out? When? I why, had did to, you, why did you start hyperventilating? <laughs> Not really hyperventilating, but he saw a look on my face. Yeah. When? I, I wasn't listening. Fuck! I was get Mash dodge, you idiot! Do I have invisibility frames? Yes! Good! And if you time it correctly, you do like a sick dodge. Like a good dodge. Like if you time it good. Don't be like a, a, a sprite from Final Fantasy and not dodging! See? Oh, I did the Bayonetta dodge! Uh, uh, yes, kind of, almost, but not really, but yeah. You don't get witch time. 
not yet. And I don't turn into bats. Uh, oh, that's what you think. Yeah, okay, yeah. No, I was thinking of the base one. Of the bat within. Okay, who shot at that? Who indeed? Uh, and wait, didn't we just uh, take off the scoops on that one? Oh, hello, it's you. Oh, um, you recognize him. Oh, I, I recognize him. Yeah? Oh, that lip sync. Holy shit. Uh, Kyle McCarley. Oh, it's like the Voice. fucking. My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. Is the goodest boy. So, was that big old buzzsaw the Goliath you came here to take out? No. Just another defensive system. Oh. Well, okay, that's not what I thought I it was. Find the target then, huh? It looked like a one. But so I guess I can see I know. what it is. I know what you were thinking about. The mm -hmm. They're not unrelated. You, you'll see. So, uh, Speaking I of bad lip sync, uh, I recently rewatched a few episodes of Beyblade Metal Fusion. Don't go forward. Go back. I want to talk about a thing. Uh, because remember me telling you that you can beat this game in like 10 minutes? Yeah. If you... Uh, not there, if you look back... If you look look around, a little to your right. A little more to your right. See those barrels there? Yeah. If you stand between them and hold... I think it's... Uh, don't, don't do it, by the way. It's either right trigger or left trigger. I think it's right trigger. And then you input uh, left, right, left, up, down, square, circle, triangle, cross, uh, while still holding the trigger. Don't, by the I way. just jumped. Yeah. Uh, if you do that, you go immediately to the final ending. That was this last secret that was hidden for three years and ten months. Whenever people were like, you think everyone's found every secret in Automata? Yokotaro would be like, ah, there's still something left. And then someone posted that, and Yoko Taro's on, on Twitter was like, dot dot dot, dot dot dot, dot dot dot, dot. three years, ten months. <laughs> so yeah, by all means, fill out your weapons. You have a. Yeah, I have post combos. Um, do you? A little bit. Look, so that's the basic one, and then if I pause after this one. No, no, no. That's a hold. Oh, I don't. No, what you do have is oh, light attacks. Uh, you can do like a big long string with your light attacks, and at any point you can press the heavy attack button to do a combo finisher. Hmm. And you'll mm. you'll be using both the weapons you have equipped. Hey, press up on the D-pad. On the D-pad. Yes. Uh, this is the same two weapons, but now you have the big sword set to light attacks and the and the small sword to heavy attacks. Because you can set any weapon to any attack button. Uh, Does it become different attacks? Yes. Huh. Uh, any weapon can be used. I kind of like this one more. Uh, feel free to experiment. Uh, you also have you you notice that you have launcher. If you go jump and then immediately heavy attack, you have a launcher. You need to kind of slide it. It's a it's a bayonetta launch. Like the moment your feet leave the ground, you want to be hitting attack. There you go. You can do sick shit like that. So the, there is stuff. There's a lot of stuff. Uh, and also, whenever you want to go somewhere, you want to start with a dash, and if you keep holding, you'll go into a higher speed. Look at her character design, she's so good. Everyone was like... Like, I think the reveal trailer was like the shot of her breaking through the wall, and everyone mm -hmm. like... And everyone like, shut up and listened immediately. <laughs> yeah, I can imagine a lot of porn sites have been funded oh, yeah. just oh, yeah. by her. Oh yeah. Co <coughs> cosplay, animations... Art, everything. Everything. Uh, you feel free to go ahead, by the way. Uh, but it was like I didn't know who Yokotaro was at this time uh, when this game was announced. I didn't know about everything. I knew about Platinum, and I was like, "Huh." 
uh, another Platinum game, and Platinum was like on top of their game at that point. And I was like, I'm interested in this video game. Oh, it is connected to another video, it, it's a sequel to another video game, how interesting. Uh, and so I started researching that video game and I went down the fucking crazy ass rabbit hole you guys know about now. Yep. <laughs> Wait, what? For me, I knew of Nier Automata because everybody just went, oh, it's a, it's a good game. For me, it was like, eh, I'm not even interested, I'm not yeah. even gonna try it. I heard about it, but I never, like, got interested. Because yeah. you, Animatrix, eh. Well, is that how it'd be? <laughs> I was kind of like that before. And then I was like, oh, anime! Whoa, that's kind of cool. I'm still having problems with anime. Yeah. I mean... I can count on one hand, with all my fingers, on how many animes I like. Really? Yeah. It's huh. that few. Which ones? Well, Metal Alchemist, the uh, old one, and Brotherhood, Helsing, and even, even fucking Galleon. Helsing hmm. Ultimate or just normal Helsing? Helsing Ultimate is better than normal Helsing. Yeah. Uh, and by the way, there was the option to set language to Japanese, which I did uh, the first time I played. Oh, you've clicked the stick, I see. You can turn off and on the light on your pod. Uh, with a click of the right stick. I will turn it on. Uh, ma'am? What is it? I was going to send you the map data I collected earlier. Do it. Hey, uh, we're a map. Mini map. I think this game has a really, really good English dub. It's uh, a really good... It's a really good voices and whatnot, even though I saw with the lip sync was a little bit if, but yeah, that's, yeah, that's that, my that, that, that uh, critical little eye. Uh, speaking it's, of lip sync is hard when it's like it is always hard on pre-rendered you... animation and stuff. Oh yeah. Speaking of lip sync and so stuff, uh, full uh, Beyblade Metal Fusion. That's why are you keeping? Why, why do you? Why did you bring that up about again? Uh, that's a show that I really liked as a kid. I rewatched some episodes and realized that the voice acting was like, I am going to defeat you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but this, anyways, is Kira Buckland. Who uh, is? You are toast. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Kira, to be here is Kira Buckland, who is notable for a few things. Uh, That's an item over there. there, by the way. There was something over there. Uh, most recently, perhaps as the English Ooh. voice for Julian Kujo in JoJo's. Oh shit, she is. Yeah. Uh, I know her best as fucking. And I didn't know this until pretty recently, but she's fucking Girl Chan from Girl Chan in Paradise. What Do you guys know what the fuck Girl Chan in Paradise no. is? It's a Newgrounds animation made by uh, Eager Raptor among a couple of others. Oh him. Yeah, and it's like it's a very Why funny parody. It's a very funny parody of uh, like. Anime tropes. Uh, you can go in there now. I think. All right. I mean, y you can explore as much as you want. Y this is a game you need to take your time with. Uh, it's a very funny anime parody, where the main character hardly ever appears, and she's girl Chan, and she's only there to wear bikinis and have her massive honkers flip around, and she's apparently played by Kira Buckland. I didn't know that, but apparently she got her start as like doing voices for like animations and stuff on the internet. I guess. Yeah. Well, we need to start it end somewhere. Uh, her. Honestly, is I'm, I'm I kind of don't even want to say it because I think Kira Buckland does a good job, but also to be is like the one character I think. I definitely prefer in Japanese. Uh, yeah. The Japanese voice is uh, Yui Ishikawa, uh, who you might recognize as Mikasa from Attack on Titan, uh, who, who is a very similar type of character, or at least speaks in a similar manner. You don't have endless heals, by the way. Fucking hate balls! Just hit them. As 
fucking kill them all. Kill them all. Kill them all, Peter. That's still the funniest fucking thing to me, like edits of Uncle Ben telling Peter like on his with his dying breath. Kill them all. Kill, kill them all, Peter. <laughs> uh the fucking funny Spider-Man thing I've seen in a while is uh the one solid JJ video. It's a, it's a guy who does those, uh, like, old school... Yeah. Yeah. When... Are you talking about fucking Big Wheel? No, not that one. Uh, not the that one, one about uh, No Way Home, where in the end it's like... Two other Spider-Mans. Mm. Tobey Maguire's... You know, I caught Keep a, going, my girlfriend way. and a bus once, and... Uh, Andrew Garfield starts crying, that was funny. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. Why? Scanners like me mostly work alone. Scouting out enemy lines and all that. Is he a hacker a man? Fun. Prohibited. So the those sound hiccups happen when the controller comes unplugged. Stop calling me man. Huh? It's unnecessary. All right then. Uh, yes, he is a hacker man. There are in fact edits of him. Why the fuck do you just run into the enemy? You don't hey, I can't Fucking try not to pull the cord out on the fucking controller. I'm trying not to move the controller at all. Also 2D segments. Yes. Just pull the cord a little more towards you and it won't be so tense. I'm just gonna shoot him. Anyways, that was 9S talking again. He's a very good boy. Uh, by the way, you can access your items. Uh, by pressing down on the d-pad and you can use them at any time. Oh shit, I'm climbing. You're, you're climbing a ladder. Uh, 2B, uh, no, 9S is played by Kyle McCarley, who, uh, he, he's one of those guys who voices like, uh, 15 different characters in every anime, you know. He's, mm -hmm. He does additional voices. There's a thing over there if you want. <coughs> uh, but he's also had some bigger roles lately. Uh, notably, he's... I think he's the main character in Demon Slayer in the English dub. I haven't seen Demon Slayer. I haven't seen it, but I've heard of it. I've heard that people enjoy it. You know, I think I think you're eating ass because uh, you're using the big sword with the slow attacks as your quick. You should probably have your quick sword as your quick. Fine. Because you end up being too slow to hit the bullets coming to you. Uh, Cal McCarley is also English uh, Tada no Hito Hito from uh, Komi-san. Do you know about uh, Komi-san wa Komi Shou Des or um, what's the English title? Kom mm. kom komi, komi can't communicate. What? I don't know. I've never heard I do it. not understand. It's what can she communicate? Is it her feelings? Is it a wrong com? It is a rom-com, she can't communicate her feelings, in fact she can barely- Oh wait, is it uh, the one who looks like uh, a shocked reindeer all the time? Yes. Always staring. Oh, I know her though. Yeah, uh, she, she has like serious social anxiety, can't look, in her, can't look people in the eye, can't like speak mm -hmm. if someone is looking at her. Uh, and then she meets this guy who like understands kind of. And, like helps her get friends and shit. Why don't you dodge? Why don't you dodge when the attacks come at you? <laughs> you can cancel your attacks into a dodge. It's an action video game. Uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't. I don't know, man. In Devil May Cry, I just press the buttons and no, the enemy dies. No, you don't. Dies. Well, it's become like second nature. Yes, to, because to you combo. took the time to learn. Take the time to learn here. <laughs> I hate top down. You have one recovery left. I'm going to be fucking pissed if we're gonna be stuck doing uh. another half hour of tutorial before we can move on. Oh boy. Uh, so the, the it's a it's a contextual hold slash toggle by the way. If you hold it, it's gonna be a hold. If you press it, it's gonna be a toggle. The lock on. Oh, so yeah, you're the on. Lost one. Yep. I think you might have medium recoveries as well. I don't know if it will auto use those. See, if you dodge and immediately press your quick attack, you go into an extra good launch. 
Like that. There's something to your right. Uh, there is something to your right. Good eye. There. Yeah, there. I thought it was and just And also lighting. further to your right. Hey, look, it's a... It's, it's a, a robot. These are robots. Ah, fuck. Why did you not dodge? Because uh, I was thinking fucking... Uh, Don't think. Just uh, hit. I was thinking action video game. Yeah, trickster, that's on the B button. Okay, think... Ah, uh, I see. You know, I actually like this control scheme so much that I remapped Devil May Cry to be more like it. Uh, you can't access that right now. This one? You can't access that one. Well, uh, so I like ha I like having guns on right trigger. I like having. Y that's a door to your right. I saw. Uh, this will save you a little bit of time later, if you just press that. Or it might, or it might not affect you at all. But you put down a bridge that takes you back to the beginning. Don't go back to the beginning, even though. What the fuck were we talking about? Right, Komi-san. Komi-san is a very good, uh, like, funny rom-com manga about a bunch of weirdos. It's like, uh, it's revealed that the high school they go to is like admission by interview only, and they only pick out weirdos because it's interesting. <laughs> so everyone who goes to that high school... Oh yeah, you can just continue if you want to, if you don't want to fight them. I gotta get... I gotta get good. I mean, yes, but also. Holy fuck, that's a lot of dudes. Yeah. Uh, you do have a slightly different attack if you dash and hit an attack button. So like a dash, uh, a dash heavy attack is pretty good for crowd control. There we go. There's a guy in the corner. He's, he got oh, stuck. There. there he is. He's stuck. Yeah. And they timed it out perfectly. So that... Yeah. Just... You can keep your distance with it. Ah, shit. Alright, use a medium recovery. You have five of those. Okay, so you, we're, we're not that boned. But still, try not to be in the position where everyone can hit you. <laughs> hey, did you ever try your big laser? What? Uh, big wheel? Uh, which one? I think it's... Big wheel? I think it's L, uh, left bumper. If you hold that, you charge up a laser and then you... Ah, you <laughs> missed. <laughs> uh, that, that's gonna be basically your... Well, what? you might notice that this is similar to uh, how the first Nier was, so that you had your magic bullets and then you're gonna have your spells. Except they're not spells, they're pod programs. And the pod program you currently have is a big laser. Oh, you only have one pod program at a time? Yes. You could switch out the small, quick lasers in assault, right? Uh, yeah, you can't do that here. Uh, but there is a way to have multiple... To, to ha be able to switch between up to three different pod programs at most. You missed uh, so something there. Yeah. That's fine. I mean, these are not the most important items, the, uh, the enemy drops. Okay, fair. Uh, very good. Uh, red means you can't. By the way, this pod is voiced by DC Douglas. Hmm. DC Douglas was Grimoire Noir in the first game. The evil Grimoire. Nice. There was. See these Giga Brain Chads with their fucking shields to block your bullets? They came in with a plan. Oh shit. Well, I have a big ass sword. You do have a sword. Plan for that, not did ya? Parry this, you filthy cash. Ow! Uh, says, <laughs> parry this, you filthy cash, and he gets smacked in the face. Yeah, that was, okay. uh, it was, that was perfect timing. Instant karma, I believe they call it. Fucking, Dodge. they telegraph so early that they're gonna <laughs> fucking hit you. I think I bumped the mic. That wasn't good. Ah, uh, it's probably fine. It's a lot less of a concern since I got my shock mounts. Shock mounts? That little basket that they're hanging in. Oh. The microphones. It means that if I were to like 
kick the mic stand, I, I've got mine on. It wouldn't be an, an issue. See? Just fucking do that. Oh, you wanna see something cool, by the way? Uh, we'll do it uh, in a second. Once you're done with this fight. Bullet. Ow. The fucking worst position. Yes. So, get out of that position. No, but they dropped on me. I was rude. Hmm. I thought you meant the fact that you were stuck between a rock and a hard place, as it were. There will be uh... I'm sitting in the sofa, I'm not stuck. I'm not stuck in here with you, you're stuck in here with me. Ah, shit. Oh, fuck. I have a plan. It's called... Juggle! Usually, usually when you have a plan, it goes something it's wrong. Some... Usually my plan is hee hee hoo hoo. I remember... Like, the first big D&D campaign we played before Vigo joined. Well, he joined at the end. Yeah. But, like, the arc words of that campaign was, Don't worry, guys, I have a plan. <laughs> yeah. And surprisingly often when I ask you where So you wanna see something cool, hand me the give me the controller real quick. I'm still surprised that every time he said it it, it actually works. So like you can can you can like cancel any attack. But some attacks have a point where the attack is initiated and and like it stays out. So I start moving, but that sword is still gonna hit. Hmm. And you can do that with your launcher, like uh, fuck. Let me... See, did you see that? Mm-hmm. So, you can do a launcher to someone and then just not continue with it. You can do a bunch of cool shit in this game. Uh... You know what? I think we're gonna step out of that door on the next episode. Mm-hmm.